welcome to a day in my life. I need my specs because I cannot see without them. Uh, I'm going to try and make this day as productive as possible and give you guys a sneak peek into what really goes on in a day in my life. So I usually start off by making my bed and that's exactly what I'm going to do. Um, I just like doing this because it just makes me feel good and gives me a good kickstart to the day. So I just like doing this and then I'm going to freshen up real quick. time to get some breakfast and my maid usually comes in the morning so she's already made poha for me but I'm gonna make some cold coffee for myself I feel like if you've been watching most of my day in my life vlogs my older ones you know I cannot start my day without cold coffee so that's exactly what I'm gonna do okay, okay so we've got two lactose free milks I'm not lactose intolerant but for some reason I just prefer lactose flavor because these come in these tiny tetra packs which is very convenient to store and use. So let's get started. I usually prefer putting jaggery as in good ka powder. I'm gonna put some ice cubes and then my cold coffee will be ready. So I have my poha and my cold coffee and I'm just gonna write down my to do's for the day I usually do this every morning so I know exactly what I want to do a couple of things that I need to do is I happen to drop cold coffee on my laptop and my bag last night so I need to give my bag for dry cleaning I need to give my laptop for um, servicing it's actually working thankfully but it still needs to be clean so someone's gonna come and pick that up and uh, I also have to go to the hair salon because it's been a while and my hair desperately needs some nourishing so that's on my agenda as well I have to edit some reels I have to shoot some photos for uh, the Mintra studio and um, yeah I think that's about it and of course the workout as well. I'm going to get in a quick 30 minute workout before I head out and run my errands. So I did a quick home workout using my 8kg kettlebell. It's great for just working out at home. I'm going to quickly go get changed and shower and then start with my errands. I've had a quick shower, now I'm headed to the salon. I'm going to Glam Labs for my hair treatment. My hair tends to get really thin and dry towards the end, especially because it's long. So I'm doing the L'Oreal Professional Steri Expert Hair Care Treatment today. I'm obviously gonna walk you guys through the process. Before that, I'm just gonna quickly drop my bag for dry cleaning and then uh, we'll head to the salon. By the way, I got this fan from Amazon. It's so convenient because I tend to sweat a lot uh, and this really just helps me not break out into pimples and acne when it's really, really humid and hot. When you come in for the treatment, the hairdresser will usually recommend what range you should use for the treatment and I'm going to be using the Pro Longer treatment. It's perfect for long hair like mine which are thin and dry towards the ends. This is the major issue that I'm dealing with and this L'Oreal Professional Seri Expert hair treatment is going to help me with that. So we've done with the first step and now I'm going to move on to cleansing with the shampoo. So after the shampoo, the next step is to apply mask, a massage and then a little bit of steam. thoroughly enjoyed the treatment my hair desperately needed it and it looks so so much healthier now in fact L'Oreal Professional Cellie Expert hair treatment is for literally 
they have a range for everyone so if you're dealing with frizziness oiliness or dandruff they do have a range for everything so you can book a consult with the hairdresser he will recommend he or she will recommend a treatment to you and i will link it down below for you guys so you can you know easily book an appointment and get your treatment done i am super excited to also take the home range the retail range of the prolonger treatment along with me because i need to be using it for healthier hair This is done and picked from my to-do list for today. Next up, I have to finish work. I have to shoot some couple of pictures and also edit them. So I'm gonna just take a break right now. When I got home, I was super hungry, so I decided to have a quick lunch and then sit down to edit my photos and then wrap up my shoot as well. a day just wrapped up all the work and all my errands i did also start my day early and it's about 6:30 pm right now so i'm going to relax chill take the makeup off do some skin care maybe put on a mask and watch some netflix but the video ends right here i hope you guys enjoyed it if you want me to do more of these day in my life vlogs please let me know in the comments down below and i will do more of these for you guys and uh, yeah i'm going to sign off and i will see you guys in my next video